Homes for Now, a low barrier housing program to house the homeless in South Bend is not only full, the wait to get in is backed up until Christmas. The motel can hold up to 110 people, but Director Sheila McCarthy says the number of people that need somewhere to sleep in South Bend tonight is much bigger than that. What our city really needs is a year round weather amnesty where someone can be inside out of the elements, have a safe place to sleep overnight. The lack of other overnight resources is why McCarthy says the city sees some sleeping outside or in tents. Although she says South Bend is in a much different position now than it was the summer of 2020 when the organization opened. Motels for now originally began housing those who had been homeless for years. McCarthy says that's not often the case anymore. The people that are coming in now, almost all of them have been homeless for less than a year. She says the reason for the recent spike in homelessness is because the eviction moratorium was lifted. Motels for now did receive additional funding this year as it plans to build a new facility. That money granted by the city in March. A spokesperson for South Bend released a statement on the city's current homelessness population saying in part, the city is doing more than ever to alleviate chronic homelessness in our community and will continue to advance evidence based approaches such as housing first. McCarthy says her biggest concern going forward is that the housing Choice Voucher Program has also just ended, which was a federal program that helped low-income families stay in the private housing market. McCarthy says she hopes to see some other assistance for the homeless soon. I'm John Paul. Thanks for watching. Here's another video for you to watch. Also, please take a moment to subscribe to our channel.